हाय फ्रेंड्स वेलकम हाउ आर यू ऑल आई एम होपिंग यू ऑल आर डूइंग वेल हैप्पी ट्राइंग टू बी हैप्पी बिकॉज ट्राइंग इज ऑल एवरीथिंग यू नीड टू ट्राई टू डू व्हाट यू वांट टू डू सो इफ यू वांट टू बी हैप्पी ट्राई टू बी हैप्पी एंड सी इट विल बी अ सक्सेसफुल थिंग फॉर योर लाइफ ओके सो टुडे what happens that i have covered saturn saturn first house for all the 12 ascendant and i was thinking that should i make this video or not because i was thinking that i should make more videos about other planets also but uh, my conscious didn't allowed me to do that so i was not satisfied with uh, with finishing like this after doing 12 houses of saturn and then go move for moving forward to other planets my conscious didn't made me feel comfortable so i felt came i should make a video about saturn so today's video is about what is saturn so before i start this video i have to speak few things about my free reading process that i have started I have made two videos regarding free kundli reading, and by twenty fifth, I have requested to requested all of you to give your details, and uh, I will try to give you a free reading about yourself, about your two questions, about your personality. Uh, there are lots of kundlis are given to me, and those kundli means I have lot of kundli right now. i have to select which is i do which i don't want to i want to give all the readings but believe me that i'm getting lots of kundli and humanly possible i have to i have to think my human abilities also so my human abilities will how much i can make and how much i can read because i get personal reading also and other things also other readings also so it will be complicated for me to read all the kundlis but i will try to do as much as possible do not get disheartened because if your kundli is not written if it's not predicted or i am not able to read it right now i will read it in later later on you just need to do the process thing which i will let you know on after 25th after reading giving you the free kundli reading of selected people okay so that is done now i want to speak to you about what is saturn because what happens is that that saturn is a very strong planet people makes it very cruel planet and it people say it's a malefic planet bahut ganda planet hai this and that and people believes in it because they suffer through life and they feel that saturn is a malefic planet what people those who have knowledge doesn't make you and realize is that that they say they saturn is a judge they will give you but what kind of they say they, it's a judge that it will he will give you your karma's result they will give you this that and you have to do your good karma hey wo and if you don't do that you will suffer and this and that part of it's right if you do not do a good karma then you will not uh, you will not get rewards right good rewards even if you are getting today a good reward in future you will not get a good reward in the end you will not be happy if you do not do a right karma that 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 is a life knowledge as a life theory in life you have to do good karmas right karmas right work that's that was that what make us a good human being right a human being you if you can't be a good human being try to be a human being so when you be trying to be a human being then you have to do some good work right so that's given like why why you have to blame saturn for it in the end saturn is a balancing planet saturn gives you what you should deserve why i am saying what should what do you deserve saturn can be a saturn can be a harsh planet but it's not a extremely harsh planet okay try to understand it's a harsh planet but it's not a extremely harsh planet for an instance somebody somebody 
is driving his car and he met with the accident now everybody say the oh, who oh, so bad such a bad thing happened to you we feel bad for you and uh, he will say why this thing happens to me means he is a nice person imagine he is a nice person and still he met with the accident he had some injuries not major but minor injury semi minor inju- injuries and now he is saying ke yaar but he is in hospital right now so he is like yeah, why this is happening to me right and some astrologers comes um, that person some concerned person like mother or father asks to a astrologer sir what happened to my son sir tell me sir what happened and he is like astrologer oh your son shani is in mahadasha or antardasha or your son has a drishti of shani and that's why this is happening shani is bad you have to do शनिवार को कुछ करिए डू समथिंग ऑन सैटरडे गिव मी फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड आई विल डू फॉर यू समथिंग फॉर सैट ऑन सैटरडे सो दिस हैपन्स दिस इज वट नॉर्मल पीपल थिंक यूजली पीपल थिंक दिस हैपन्स बट इमेजिन दिस वैन यू आर इन हॉस्पिटल वैन यू आर इन बेड दिस दिस न्यूज वेंट टू सम पीपल who knows you and that those people put forward this news to some concerned persons whom you are not in relationship right now whom with whom you don't want to contact you don't you don't talk because of your personal feelings now that concerned person comes to you in your life knowing that you had a accident you met with the accident and does whatever he and she can possible for you to make you feel well and to make you well that person sticks with you from today onwards because you realize that this person is the is my go to guy whether it's a, it's a woman it's a man whether you are a man whether you are a woman you realize that it's a go to guy a go to person it's a person who is like for me who will be there for me you realize that you made a mistake or you both realize you committed a mistake because inside you you had a feeling for each other and you didn't accept it now you accepting it fine so this is sign balancing you met with the accident because you were not willing to let go your ego your attitude Saturn was helpless. He wanted to give you something good in your life, and you were not willing to accept it because you thought, "Okay, this is my life, and this is great." And Saturn tried to give you that. Now it's up to you. After having all this, whether you want to able to keep that thing or not. If you keep on thinking that this is a mistake, this is a mistake. Why accident happens to me? You will, you will. not be able to enjoy the thing which saturn was trying to give you i'm not saying having an accident is a good thing i'm just saying the saturn makes things balancing when you can't do your balancing work saturn comes and does that for you most of the times another example you can take that you are in in a relationship and uh, you are not quite happy with it but you are in a relationship because you are committed to person now saturn comes in a mahadasha antardasha or anything lagna and all and what happens that you get an opportunity to work somewhere else far from your present location and you realize that if i go to that place i will be ab- i won't be able to keep this relationship in a place where it is right now now you have to analyze yourself that whether this relationship has that potential has that quality to keep fighting for it or you should think that 
I should try to move out of this relationship and test myself whether I want to be in this relationship or not. So Saturn gives you that opportunity. Now you say, you complain, yeah, why is this happening to me? Why is this opportunity coming to that place that far? Why it doesn't comes to this place? If it, it comes to my location, then I won't be able to move. I, I, I won't need to move. And if I don't need to move, I am happy because I have in a pathetic or like in a complicated relationship, but it will improve. It will improve if I get a good job. Right? That's what you think. Like it will improve. It will improvise because I get more money. I will be more happy. Right? It's not. Saturn is trying to test you and making a balancing act for you. If she or he loves you, he will keep on loving you whether you are in this location or that location. He will try or he, she will try to do the best for you. Maybe now you have to think that what should I do? But you should go to the, that place. It's up to you. Or if you feel that no, this is more important for me, for this, for my life, this relationship is important for me, then Saturn is trying to tell you that you are unhappy because of your materialistic needs. If you leave your materialistic leave needs, then you will be more happier with your loved ones. Okay. So this is the way Saturn balances things out. I am trying to tell you about Saturn right now is that because everybody blames Saturn for many things. Try to remember is that that other planets are very harsh when they comes in your Mahadasha or do any when they are in a bad position they give you a very instant and very bad bad effects but Saturn tries to balance it out and even in a bad situation it tries to if you do good karma it will give you a positive result not in a higher amount but in a balancing amount maybe the balancing will be not educate educate enough for your expectations but it will be there try to understand that what the problems in your life is not a problem in your life it's your expectation from your life uh, good great thinker has said once in a once somewhere i have read it that what is stress stress is something the difference between your present and your expectations the distance between that is stress so reduce your stress try to live your in your life peacefully happily okay so this is what saturn does now let's go let's uh, analyze saturn regarding uh, uh, like in a practical way saturn gives you a good result at the age of 36 when 35 to 36 is a maturity age for saturn it gives you a good result for the lagna of taurus for the lagna of gemini for the libra for the virgo for the sagittarius for the Capricorn and Aquarius and for Pisces. Saturn does good things, great things, average things. But rest of the Lagnas are not suitable for Saturn. Wherever this Lagna, rest of the Lagnas are the Lagna where Saturn is not comfortable and Saturn gives, Saturn does become malefic. Okay. But the malefic result is on the balancing act. It's not like any other planet. Okay. So this is Saturn. Saturn is more happy in uh, Libra because it's a Yogkarak planet in Libra. Saturn is happy in uh, Aquarius. This both these two lagnas are very good for Saturn. Sagittarius is good. These things are there. Okay, if Saturn is placed in a good place in this lagnas, Saturn give you a good result. Third thing, Saturn does not give you pain instantly. Saturn does not give you happiness instantly. It gives you everything when you deserve it. You have to create the ability, then only it gives you. Pain it gives you to understand yourself. Happiness it gives you when you deserve it. Okay. 
but for aquarius and for other good lagnas it does give you a peaceful life but a stressful a stress st stressful brain mind is stressful because saturn, saturn is trying to make you mature as much as it possible so this happens with saturn in my life span i have understood that there are two people of personalities in people there are majorly two personalities givers and takers so those who are givers you are a giving personality saturn will help you in that remember this that give compassion not your sound mind there is a difference between being compassionate and kind and giving up your sound mind your peace of mind okay so don't you being a giver then give compassion kindness not stress do not take stress don't be a don't give your soundness and don't give your peaceful mind if you want to give help someone help someone by your words do little karma but most importantly help by your words you do not do physical activities to help people unless you get paid even 1 rupee if you get 1 rupee paid to get paid okay doctor doesn't get paid it doesn't works there are very few doctors who works for free if a if a doctor is working he says i have done if a genuine social worker working doctor is working he still gets 1 rupee 10 rupees because he wants to get paid he wants to get fit and that is the fact help people by your words not by physical activities because when you do the physical activities there are two major things only when you do the physical activities one when you are in love second when you get paid up you do not take somebody's cutleries you do not wash utensils you do not cook for somebody you do not wash wash clothes for somebody unless you are in love help when somebody is dying or in a situation that he may die you try to help that but in major situation they get help they what you do you get paid right but if nobody is there you do that but try to understand what i am saying help by word by not your act because when you do the act on the name of helping you are trying to love that person and that will create more an imbalance in your life try not to do that compassion kindness try to do that as much as possible help try to do that by words as much as possible advise them try to negotiate for them do whatever you want to do but with keeping in mind that your brain need to be in free and stressless zone okay now those who are takers like about the givers you will give on your life and you will accept little things from your from them and you be happy right if you don't do that then you are not a giver you if you start expect, ex, expecting things from others for your deeds then you are not a giver you are just balancing out ठीक है सो ट्राई टू अ गिव अ इट विल बी बेटर एवरीबडी यू कॉन्ट बी अ लाइक अ पर्सन दैट हु ओनली गिव्स डज नॉट एक्सपेक्ट एनी थिंग इट इज पॉसिबल दैट यू हैव एक्सपेक्टेशन एंड दैट इज नेचुरल फॉर अ ह्यूमन बींग बट ऑफकोर्स ट्राई नॉट टू थिंक अबाउट इट वट यू गिव टू अदर्स जस्ट गिव एंड बी हैप्पी टू नॉट एक्सपेक्ट एनी थिंग्स बिकॉज दैट विल ऑल्सो क्रिएट अ मेंटल स्ट्रेस नाउ those who are takers take things as much as you can because you will not stop 
I am not gonna stop you because Saturn is not gonna balance you right now. Take as much as you can. When there is nobody left to give you anything, give whatever you have to the younger version of you, the taker, the younger version of you, the taker. Okay, now you give to that taker. That is the balancing act of Saturn. So this is my review about Saturn and about human nature when Saturn comes in life. Subscribe my channel if you like my videos and uh, like and share. Okay. Thank you.